When you hear Timber Sports, your first thought is probably burly men in flannel, but the top collegiate and professional Timber Sports athletes are at the scope this weekend competing in the U.S. Steel Timber Sports Championships. Well, I think the spirit of competition, you know, we all are having fun out here. We're not doing this for millions of dollars. You know, this is taking people back to the old state fair where, you know, you competed for the sake of competing. For many of these athletes, participating in timber sports has been passed down generation to generation. A lot of these guys grew up and have it in their blood. They're third and fourth generation athletes. So before they could walk, they're thinking about grabbing an axe and a chainsaw. So it's not really a question about what they love about it. It's, you know, how do they turn it off? With saws and axes, these athletes participate in six timed events, but one seems to stand out as the fan favorite. But then the, the, what really gets their motors going is the hot saw event. You know, a 70 pound, 70 uh, horsepower motor that you're holding in one hand and, and making three cuts in six inches. I mean, there's a lot of power. They make it look easy, but it takes incredible strength and skill. Strength, you know, strength is, is part of it. You can't discount that. Uh, technique, though, is I'd say they go hand in hand 50-50. Uh, you'll see great big guys that just struggle if they don't have the technique. You'll see small guys that can compete with the big guys because they've got outstanding technique. Hannah Billings, 13 Sports, Norfolk.